Hey guys, it's Elboy Carson here with another video, and in this video, I am going to unbox and review the Apple Pencil, specifically how it works on the iPad Pro 10.5 inch. Now before I get into it, just spend 2 seconds, just 2 seconds liking and subscribing to the channel. It'll mean a lot to us. Thanks. The Apple Pencil comes in a very sleek and small box. Now in the front, you can see the life-size Apple Pencil. It sure does look sexy. Once you peel the wrapper carefully, unlike me, you simply just slide another box within the box. It just says it's designed in California, that's all. Now the first thing you'll see is a packet. The packet contains quite a lot, so stay with me. First, it contains a lightning adapter. With that, you can use it to charge the pencil with a standard lightning cable. The package also contains an extra tip for the Apple Pencil, so when the old tip is no good anymore, you can replace it. The little packet also includes a quick start guide to show you how to use and charge your Apple Pencil. Also some more stuff. Paperwork. Oh boy. The last thing in the box is the Apple Pencil just waiting for your little greasy hands to touch it. But first, you twist the plastic paper to unwrap the pencil, and now you're all set. Now on the top of the pencil, you can see or try to see the Apple Pencil logo on the top part. Now the round top is actually the cap of the Apple Pencil. Once you pull it out, you can see the lightning connector. The cap is held on magnetically, so you just pop it in and it shouldn't fall out as easy. So for the tip of the Apple Pencil, it certainly looks like a real pencil's tip. Once you twist it out, you can see the highly responsive sensors. The Apple Pencil has a heavier weight on one side, so the logo will always be on the top. The Apple Pencil works by Bluetooth, so you need to pair it. But how do you pair it? You just insert the lightning connector to your iPad Pro. Then, you agree to pair, and voila. The pair looks a little weird though, but don't mind, it's just how they do it. For charging the Apple Pencil, it's the same principle. You just insert the lightning connector to your iPad, but don't worry, it should charge fairly fast, I hope. You can also see the battery percentage of your iPad Pro and Apple Pencil from the top. I have to say, the pencil works really fine, and I will tell you more about it in about 5 seconds, after you see my terrible handwriting. Now here's the speed of the pencil's latency in real time, and this is the speed of the pencil's latency in slow motion. Now with ProMotion technology, Apple claims that the latency for the iPad Pro 10.5 inch is only 20 milliseconds. And Microsoft Surface Pen has a latency of 21 milliseconds. Looks like another victory for Apple. Hooray! That's great news. Now the Apple Pencil is super dope because it has the same principle as a physical pencil. The highly responsive sensor built into the tip of the pencil to detect position, force, and tilt. So if you press lighter, the lines will become more shallow and if you press harder, the lines become deeper. Now to use the Apple Pencil productively, you should download the app Procreate. Procreate is a professional drawing app that uses the Apple Pencil. It costs $5.99 from the App Store. Speaking of professional, I am no professional at drawing. I got the app and I have to say, it is a really hardcore drawing app. Since I am a Star Wars fan, and most of my subscribers are also Star Wars fans, I decided to draw some characters from the movies. At first, everything seemed so complicated, but with a little practice, I kinda got the hang of it, and I really, really enjoy drawing on this app, and I will continue to draw more things and characters and sketch more and have fun with the app in the future. You can do simple swiping using the Apple Pencil on the iPad Pro 10.5 inch, but you cannot swipe down to get notifications. You'd have to swipe down with your hands. Honestly, the Apple Pencil is actually used for more precise work like drawing and writing. For the others, just let your fingers do the job, will ya? So this is my unboxing and review for the Apple Pencil for the iPad Pro 10.5 inch. The Apple Pencil costs about $99. So yeah, did you enjoy my video? If you did, please like, comment down below, and subscribe. And have an awesome day, or night.